So today we're going to talk about Czechoslovakian's military. Because man's not joking, he's been demanding this. So without further ado, let's talk about Czechoslovakia. Czechoslovakia has a population of 10 million people, 5 million manpower, and 4 million fit for service. With a reaching age of military annually, 97,000 people. On the scale, that's not very large, but they themselves are not a very large country. So, gotta give them the benefit of the doubt. They were also an Eastern Bloc country that had to fight for their right to party. So in this video, we will see equipment that is a little outdated, but modernized. They have a total military personnel of 25,000, followed by another 25,000 active personnel. They have zero reserves and zero paramilitary. Of course, with this website, it even states that the United States has zero paramilitary. And that's a load of bullshit. <laughs> So I'm starting to find some faults and flaws with this website. But again, like I've stated, they take census information and put it all together. So bear with them, I guess. This is why I do go out of my way to heavily research everything else on other websites prior to making these videos. They have a total aircraft strength of 90 with 12 fighters and interceptors, 16 dedicated aircraft attack, 8 transports, and 10 traders. Czechoslovakia uses the JAS-39 Gripen, which you can see here which is Swedish made, and the Aero L-159. Now they lease this aircraft that you are seeing from the Swedish. They do not actually own them. Yet. I did a little research on this aircraft. I myself have never heard of it. Um, it's apparently not bad, but it's not good. It gets the job done. It's in the gets the job done tier. They have no tanker fleet for an air resupply. They have 44 helicopters and 15 attack helicopters which are the MI-8, the MI-17, and the W-3A. And what you are seeing right here is the MI-24. The MI-24 is the main attack helicopter for the Czechoslovakian military. They have 116 tanks. The main battle tank of Czechoslovakia is the T-72M4CZ, which is an upgraded version of the T-72, which is what you are seeing here. They also field a large amount of T-72s, Eastern Bloc country. They have 440 armored vehicles. 48 self-propelled artillery batteries, which are the SHKH-77 Dana. I personally don't know how I feel about this looking at it, but it screams Soviet-inspired. Big-ass gun with that front end. Stalin is in his grave smiling at this thing. <laughs> they have zero towed artillery and zero rocket projectors. Again, small country. If I were to give them a tier, I'd say they're about mid-class. Not bad, not good. They're like Canada. They're small. That's Their downfall is they're small. Let me know down in the comments which country you would like to see reviewed next. As always, Space Dorito Guy. Have a good one, boys. Or girls, wherever you identify. Identify as an alcoholic.